Okay, wow. so let's say that, you know, you had to vote today and you had to pick one of them. You had to. You can't That's write in Rand Paul. Who, yeah. who would you vote for? I would, I would pick Trump. What? I would pick Trump. I would. Let me defend him because we're coming Please off of him. we're coming off of an administration that's had a really hard time using the T word, which is terrorism. And here you have a guy that's willing to call it what it is and willing to say this is the enemy. How does that help? This is who. How does it help? Yeah. Well, yeah. In order to in order to defeat someone, you have to be able to will, you have we, be willing to say what it is. Can I just really long time just say that it hasn't been defeated? It's, let, it's a. It's let a, her finish it's, though. Let her finish say something about Hillary Clinton. This is a woman who, after the Benghazi attacks, went on national TV, sent Susan Rice out to blame a YouTube video which had nothing to do with it. So she is the last person who should be lecturing anyone on quick responses. She perpetuated a completely but, false but can I idea. Can say this, cause, And ignored repeated Trump, requests Trump for security. Trump just said to everyone, Trump just said to everyone that the plane got blown out of the sky. Maybe that is true. But we don't know that yet. No Islamic organization has claimed responsibility for it, which they generally do. And for me, I don't want a, a president that has that kind of temperament, that is so quick to you trigger. Know what he you can't from Sonny? do that. You can't. They do don't that. like you him. Have to base it on facts. Yeah, but we he don't have the facts yet. yet. What you're describing is premature interpretation. <laughs> which yes. Is, <laughs> what is it and called? That's, <laughs> that's, I, I just think you can't be cavalier about facts. And he repeats the same false claims over and over and over again, make, trying to make them true. And that, I think, is a very dangerous quality. If I were him, I would have waited. If I were him, I would have waited a minute and had it proven that it was terrorism. I'm not, I'm not going to dispute that. But I just think it's interesting that it's coming from a woman who perpetuated something false. All right, who, let's who, talk so about that. Hot 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 do you actually think she would say that he's qualified to be president when she's running for the same job? No, I'm not surprised oh, she said that. So, I mean, I'm not I mean, surprised, it's, it's, but I think it's incorrect. And I think but, also she's using it, she's, she's saying that because he doesn't qualified. have political experience. The thing, the thing I would say about what this is... What makes her qualified? I, I looked up she's some been of, at the White House. I looked up a couple of things mean? while, while you, we were in the meetings today. But she has an actual plan to counter terrorism. Like, she what would say, it? well, she would go after ISIS's finances and infrastructure, for example. Mm -hmm. uh, she would strengthen, well, she has how a way well. to do it. Why? Do you, do you ask the same question of no, Trump? Yes, no, I do. I, I want to know how. Okay. I do. She would strengthen cooperation with moderate Muslims. He's ready to throw them all out of the country. Here's his answer. He would knock the hell out of ISIS. That's his answer. Yeah. That not is not an enough. answer. Not. I don't trust somebody who's generalizing constantly and saying stupid things well, like and that. And you can't. And let me, let me say this. I mean, you're saying that, that Hillary Clinton, in effect, is a liar. That's what, what, yes. what you're saying. Yes, 100%. Well, 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 let's talk about Trump's lies, okay? He says that he got his business from a small loan of $1 million from his father. He inherited $40 million from his father. That's one lie. He says Obama's going to admit 200,000 Syrian refugees. The real number is 10,000. And it takes he how many years before they even are vetted? Years. Yeah. He also said that it's only going to cost $8 billion to build that wall that he's so in love with. Well, it's $25 billion. Well, here's how the thing about, about but trustworthiness. The trustworthiness, I think these are probably two of the most untrustworthy candidates that well, we've ever had. So but listen, but listen, these are two of the most untrustworthy candidates. I don't trust either of them, but the fact that there, people are not looking for him to be a saint in chief. They're not voting for Trump because he's a good guy. They want somebody to shake up Washington. They he believe he can do that. She's Washington. been in Washington for how long? And a lot of people have no idea what she's truly Let done. Let me ask you this, Paula. I just mentioned That's only, true, only three, of, only three of the Trump lies. Only yeah. three. I, I've got. But a I, flip there's ten. so many. But, but I'm How many saying, lies? Why is she untrustworthy? How many lies? On the night of the told? Benghazi attack, she sent an Benghazi. email. You already said Benghazi. 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 But you, you can only get a terrorist attack. She already and it's answered it. What else? What else? Her email scandal. She gave over certain emails. How many people care about the email scandal? You care about transparency? Three people. Nobody cares. People care. Nobody cares. This is perception. This is perception. There. We were just discussing today about how many scandals that are surrounding her. There are like 20. I mean, but people what don't trust her and they don't trust him. But and that's he the says bottom line. things like, let's give Japan and South Korea uh, nuclear weapons. What type of talk is that? We're supposed to reduce the number of nuclear weapons in this world. That frightens the hell out See, of me. Joy, you're talking about stuff he says, and I'm talking about stuff Hillary has done. She do, she goes well, into wait, Libya. All, all that he's done is she gone asks, bankrupt a hundred times. She asks Gaddafi. It's a terrorist haven. She deceives you about Benghazi. She says, it's oh, it's not terrorism. It's not terrorism. In the meantime, she's telling her daughter it is terrorism. She's speaking with world leaders saying it is terrorism, and then getting on TV and saying it's not. I'm talking about this woman has a secretary, former secretary of state, she has a record, and it's a record of deceit. So I'm you'd, not rather, saying you'd rather a liar that you don't no, know what look, he's going to do than a liar that you yeah. know what she did. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's fair. <laughs> <laughs> but, 
what is what are his qualifications? What are his oh we've got to go. Yeah, when we come